What's up everybody? Uh, doing a little, uh, little experiment today with the quads. I am gonna do a back-to-back -back comparison. When we get ready for them, I won't mention what they are. Um, you will probably hear us refer to them by name. Um, my son and I like to name the quads. Um, weird, I know most people don't name your quad, don't fall in love with your quad, you're gonna destroy it, but to heck with it, we name our quads. So we'll be having uh, Lix Tetrix and Lando Nomo um, are gonna be our two subjects here. I will not tell you which one of those has 3.4 and 3.3 on it until afterwards. Should be at the location here in just a second. It's my standard stomping ground. It's a place I'm really comfortable with. I fly it a bunch. It's about 8.30 now, so um, this should give me just enough time to set up and get a battery or two out of both. Um, so yeah, we'll see how this goes. All right, the boy wants to say hi first, and then um, we'll let him go ahead and name which quad this is, so we can use it for reference later. So, all right, go ahead and say hi. 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 What kind do we got here? Um, this we're flying, and this for the first drone. Flying licks for the first drone. All right, plug it in. All right, go ahead. Flight one. Got to change the uh, VTX settings again. That's first flight. Changing batteries, switching quads. All right, I'll let Cabe lead off with the name of this quad. What do we got? We got Nando Nomo. And this is flight number two. All right, plug it in.
Alright, so let's chit chat. We've had two videos. Which one did you think was better? You probably made your mind up by now. So, first flight was from the old quad running 3.3, um, and last flight was running 3.4. Um, I can definitely tell a difference between the two. Um, it's weird. I would say that 3.4 feels a little bit more float, maybe not floaty, but just... Maybe floaty is the closest thing I can come to. Maybe even just a little bouncy, like, but in a very smooth and crisp manner. And at the same time, I felt like I had more control instead of less, with, despite feeling looser. Um, I saw areas with prop boss in both of them. I'll be curious to go through the HD footage and kind of see the difference myself, but I felt more in control with the second one compared to the first one. Yeah, uh, we'll review the HD footage, come back, chit-chat about it maybe for a quick second more, but at the end of the day, you decide, I think I might be switching, but I'll be the judge of that after I'm done. Alright, so I've had a chance to go over the footage a little bit, a couple times, take a look at what I got, and uh, afterthoughts. So, made a couple of notes here. So, um, clearly first thing, I suck at tuning. Um, I thought I had a pretty darn good tune, and from what I can see in the footage, the um, semi-default that I was pulling from 3.4 were far better than what I was able to tune out after a couple hours of a tuning session. Um, I'll get into a little bit more about the semi-default here in just a second, but um, overall I will definitely be switching over. Effective as of yesterday, the 8th. Um, the official release is on, so no point not to change both of them over since the official release is on. So, um, but like I said, at the end of the day, um, in 3.4, I just felt more confident and I felt like I had more control. And I mean, that's a no brainer. What else do you want? Um, if your footage looks just as good, um, if not better, and you feel like you have more confidence and you have more control and what else do you really want for in an upgrade i mean at the end of the day like i said you be the judge but it's new beta flight i'm sure everyone's gonna upgrade i'm sure 90 percent of the people who would want to will have um especially now since it's been out for a day but um since i had been running it for a couple of days i figured i'd show everyone else so i hope it was useful